welcome back to another video. If you are new here, hello, my name is Kira. I share videos on fashion, lifestyle, at-home beauty, vlogs, all of that good stuff here on my channel. So if you are not yet subscribed, definitely do. But today's video is going to be a Malta vlog and I am so incredibly excited because it is myself and Yosef's first time away in I don't know how long, obviously with COVID, everyone is kind of in the same situation. It is our first holiday since everything started and needless to say we are so so excited so we are currently in our hotel room because we arrived here late yesterday evening our flight was at about 6 p.m from dublin so yeah we arrived here really late and it was very dark but it's so funny when you arrive somewhere in the dark and then in the morning you whip open the curtains in your hotel and like the view is so beautiful so this is our little balcony and i'm just going to show you the view look at the ocean look at that view this morning we are just going to head out and have our breakfast and then we are going to go to the hotel's beach club so the hotel that we are staying in is the Hotel 1926. It's like a, a hotel and spa and also has its own beach club and it is so so beautiful. So the agenda for today is to go to the beach club and just have a really really chill day. Obviously it's our first day here, we want to swim in the sea, we want to soak up the sunshine and just really chill out. Alright so before we go to the beach club I'm just going to show you what I'm wearing really quickly. So this bikini is H&M. I actually picked it up recently and it's so comfortable. It's like fully lined. It's basically basically like a cupped kind of bra. And then my cover up is older, but it's just very, very handy to throw on for a little bit of coverage. And then this hat I actually just got for the trip and I absolutely love it. I love a good hat. So this hat is by Brixton. I don't know if you can see the bill there is so beautiful. It's got this like tan detail on it and it's called their Joe Straw Rancher and I absolutely love it. And then I have a pair of ASOS sunglasses that I'm gonna throw on. And then of course I have my Birkenstocks, which are just the handiest sandal for holidays. I'll be living in these. For summer in general, I have these in white and black and they are just so, so comfortable. That is what I'm wearing. We're going to head to the beach club now. I will show you when we're there. I'm going to get in the water, cool down and then definitely get a beverageino because it has to happen. So I just wanted to give you a look at the room. We just got in from the beach club. So I'm definitely in need of some sprucing, but this is the room. It's absolutely beautiful. We've got all our bags chucked here from the beach club, but I think this is a superior room. Yosef's actually sitting out on the balcony, has a little desk area. Literally all of my stuff is there. And down here, it has like a really big wardrobe area and a little coffee nook, which is very handy. There's actually loads of space in here. I've put my case in and then we've hung up some stuff. It's great. Bathroom is a great size. The shower is really, really good. Two sinks, which is stunning. There I am. And I have put loads of my products out already because it's just easier to have them to hand. The actual size of this hat, I can't go by, I love it so much. We're going to just completely chill out now, do a little bit of sprucing, get ready for our evening booking. And I'm actually so excited because we booked into this jazz bar. It's called the Bridge Bar and I was recommended it by Aideen, a friend of mine. And she said it was one of her favorite things that she did in Malta. So it's basically jazz music. Music. And actually our favorite thing to do when we travel is to go to a jazz bar, so this is ideal. As you can see I need to fix myself, but we'll talk to you later. diving school and I'm going diving for the first time in like four years. I think I'll do a quick refresher with them but I'm actually very nervous. I love diving so much but when you haven't done it in a while we're gonna do a full like morning afternoon and the weather is so beautiful and I've heard the diving in Malta is great so I know I'm in good hands. This place looks amazing. I actually feel so nervous. Anyway I'll talk to you later. Well, 
Hello. I brought my phone with me to the diving center because I figured there's no point in bringing my camera. Oh my gosh, it was such a fun day. So I had said before, I hadn't dived in about four years. I have my open water advanced, like I love diving. But when you haven't done it in a while, you, I don't know, maybe other people feel nervous as well, but I was nervous about like remembering everything. And I went and we did two dives. So my dive leader's name is Dennis. He's such a nice man. He's actually from Newcastle. Then the second dive that we did was a deep dive. So we went down to 30 meters and we did, it was like a, a shipwreck. So oh, it was amazing swimming around the shipwreck and all the fish and oh we have a dinner booking for 7 p.m but it's only about 10 minutes walk so that's really handy and we're gonna walk there so i actually just have my um, outfit ready i'll bring you over to the mirror and show you okay so this is the top that i'm wearing it's basically a bikini top that i've worn upside down so this triangle should be up this way but it's sideways and then this is the sarong that comes with the bikini it's like a little wrap and then I've just wrapped it around the back and then tied it here and then tied it here. And then the bikini has a really long strap. So I've crisscrossed it at the back. Um, this bikini is Shein, it's brilliant. It comes with a sarong and I think it's about 13 euro. I will link it below because it was still available and it's in other colors. And then these linen -y type trousers are old, but I will link some similar ones. And then again, the Birkenstocks. I brought other shoes, but as I suspected, I am just living in them. They're just ultimate summer holiday shoe. My hair, I had grand plans for doing something with it, but after washing all the seawater out of it from diving, I've just let it natural and chucked on a hairband and they're just another major key for holidays because you just don't have to do your hair. And also I need to powder because I'm very shiny. Let me just sit down here. So we're just in the hotel room and Yosef is in the shower. Myself and Yosef had like a sunset boat um, cruise, kind of like uh, it was an Airbnb experience, just the two of us on a boat with a skipper, um, like sailing around the islands and the lagoons and stuff like that. So we had a really chill morning, afternoon on the Sunday. We went to the pool, we chilled out, we got some lovely food. And it was lovely, it was really, really relaxed. And then we went on our sunset cruise and I, oh, it was so beautiful. I have so many clips from it. Um, we just had such a nice time. It was really relaxing. We snorkeled in all of the lagoons and we went to the Blue Lagoon, the Crystal Lagoon. We saw some of the caves, we went snorkeling. It was just so, so lovely. And the sunset, it was so beautiful, like amazing. We have a really fun day planned. We are going on a full like day cruise around Gozo, Camino, and some of the other kind of spots. So it's going to be like a, a hop on, hop off kind of cruise. They're gonna dock in different places. Uh, we're being picked up at 10 and it's gonna run until about 5.30. I'll show you, you'll see everything. But yeah, very excited. I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing really, really quickly. So I'm wearing another bikini set from Shein. They just are so handy, but this has a little beach skirt. So it has like a string bikini and then this handy little beach skirt. Gozo, yes. I think it's go great. Wow, I didn't get that thumbs up. Could you do that again there? Go great. Wow, um, it's very warm, but it's beautiful. It is warm. Very warm, we can't cope. So we just swam out here into this cave and it was so cool. Um, I obviously couldn't bring my camera in, but oh my God, it was so beautiful. It's absolutely roasting. So we stopped off here in Gozo and we just went in for a little swim and we're delighted. We were so hot, 
Honest to God, I can't cope with this heat, but uh, the only cure for it is just to jump in the water. So it was beautiful. You can see people climbing up there. They're gonna jump in. But yeah, it's so pretty in there. It's like a really big cave. smoked everything it like tastes incredible well hello there so it is our last full day in Malta and I'm actually so devastated I can't believe it's come around so fast I was just eating these um, I actually don't know what they're called you can get them in Dublin I've seen them in some shops but they are like ultimate holiday crisp they're like that gorgeous ready salted flavor so good so we're flying home tomorrow afternoon so we'll probably just get up go to the pool for a quick dip and then head to the airport so very very chill day tomorrow because we'll be traveling but today we have our kind of last excursion booked and it is a sunset catamaran tour around all of the lagoons the blue lagoon the crystal lagoon um, and the really nice bays and beaches so we've seen the lagoons before i think we've been to them twice already and they're just so amazing so like obviously for our last evening here the perfect way to end it would be like a nice little sunset cruise so i'm so looking forward to it the catamaran looks amazing i'll link the tours that we've booked below um they're really good value as well considering how much you get done but i'm just going to show you um the bikini that i was wearing to the pool this morning and then i'll change before the catamaran tour because i don't want to wear my wet bikini so this is the bikini from this morning it's so fun i love the color it's another like bargain bikini i will link it below i think it was like 12 or 13 euro and the bottoms are not string which I like they're kind of like high cut they're really really flattering this beach skirt I think it's from Bershka I got it on ASOS it's so handy and I think I mentioned this I can't remember but this hat is such a find it's from Amazon and it's like a really plain gardening hat um, but I saw a couple of influencers linking it because it's like I think it was 12 pounds and then free prime shipping and it's very much that style of hat that i've been seeing so much of this summer the kind of cowboy-esque style straw hat and because it is movable it's great for packing because you can flatten it and you can basically put whatever kind of style you want on it it's great so i'll link that below as well and then my trusty birkenstocks so i will check back when we are on the catamaran it's going to be stunning 